Now, Oceanographic Explorer Fabian Cousteau spent 31 days in an underwater marine laboratory near the deep coral reef in the Florida Keys. The ocean accounts for almost 100% of the planet's living space, but human activities are obviously taking a heavy toll. So what can we do to help? Well, joining us now is our friend Fabian Cousteau. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks, Thanks for coming on. Fabian, always good to have you. Now, last week, some news, President Obama pledged to expand the largest ocean sanctuary. Um, what does this mean for us, for the ocean's health? A success, <laughs> yeah. victory yeah. for the oceans. We need a lot more of those, but that's a great way to lead. And, uh, you know, if we can get about 20% of our oceans protected, I think we have a good chance at having the rest of it start getting to a semblance of health. And when, and when it's protected, what does that mean exactly? There'll well, be trash pickups or? Oh, oh gosh, I wish, I wish. <laughs> that's a monumental task. But at least it gives uh, hope zones uh, so that, that you can get overspill and you basically have a sanctuary for animals to kind of get a semblance so of So ships rest. can't go through there? In right? that particular yeah. case, there's no commercial fishing allowed. There's still traditional fishing and, and hand line fishing and that, uh, right. but really it's off limits to any kind of commercial activities. Okay. Now, um, let's talk more about your, your documentary, Mission 31. Yes. So we've been looking forward to seeing it. As you've been putting it together, looking back, has anything surprised you about the footage? So much. So we had 120 hours of footage. Obviously, I have had my nose in the ocean and was not paying attention to everything we were shooting. And there are so many little tidbits. We're going to have a teaser that we're going to show at the Blue Ocean Film Festival on November 4th, okay. which is open to the public. So anyone who wants to take a glimpse into some Where of the things that, that we've be? seen, it's in St. Pete, Florida. Okay. okay, very appropriate. Was any of this in IMAX, by the way? I'm just asking. I, I should have. We shot in time. 6K, so it okay. is IMAX worthy. Absolutely. Because yeah, sure. that's awesome to like see it on <laughs> a huge screen like, like that. Yeah. IMAX. <laughs> um, okay, so what are we going to learn in this documentary? Well, basically, it. We're focusing on the adventure aspect. You know, we, we don't want to bash people over the head with the environmentalism. Right. Of course, that'll be infused in there, but mm -hmm. it's really about the wow factor. You know, I'm seeing fish swim up behind us. Yeah. It's about what do animals do when we're not around. And the the way Mission 31, or the, the advantage of Mission 31 was we lived with them for yeah. 31 days. Our neighbors started showing us what they were doing. And your neighbors being the sharks. Right. The sharks, the fish, yeah. the sea rays. And I, mean, I think that's more inspiring, stuff. Fabian. Instead of saying, like, you have to do this, listen to this, if someone's yeah. wowed by it, then they're probably going to want to help more. Well, we did three yeah. years of science in 31 days, so obviously we're going to show some of that. Well, yeah. thank you for sharing it with us, Fabian. Thanks for being uh, here. It's a pleasure. Thank we you for having me. We will be right you. back. <laughs>